Hi everyone, thanks for watching my YouTube contents. I'm Sam Kim. Today, I would like to show you how to estimate parameters for uh, Cox proportional hazard model in uh, survivor analysis. Basics of uh, Cox proportional hazard model is like this. So, uh, HT, uh, hazard function, determined by set of P covariates, and it can be calculated by uh, baseline hazards, multiplied by exponential of regression coefficients. I mean, this covariance part. Uh, so this part, the quantities exponential of Vta i are called hazard ratio, this one. The value of Vta i from regression analysis greater than zero, or equivalently a hazard ratio greater than one indicates that as the value of i covariate increases, the event hazard increases and thus the length of survivor decreases. I will explain the meaning of this uh, text uh, a little bit later. Uh, there are some uh, uh, key points we need to understand related to Cox proportional hazard. So once you uh, divide by lambda t uh, given x, actually we can get exponential of uh, vita covariates. The right hand side is constant over time, as you can see. No term has a t in it, and the relationship is actually called proportional relationship. And also, uh, there is no uh, intercept term in the model. The Cox model lacks one because the baseline has lambda zero t takes the place of it, right? And uh, in order to uh, estimate parameters for Cox proportion hazard model, we uh, actually uh, need to use log partial likelihood. The formula for log partial likelihood is like this. This is a little bit different from uh, typical uh, uh, log likelihood because of this part and this part. Right. In our program, you can uh, do uh, Cox proportional hazard analysis by using Cox pH uh, function from survival library. Right. So once you get this output, now you can understand how to interpret exponential of coefficients. Again, uh, when you see exponential of vita i, this is actually a hazard ratio. Right. The, uh, the coefficient, uh, exponential coefficient for Rx is below uh, below than one, it means that uh, actually the uh, the event hazard uh, decreases, right? Uh, however, in terms of age uh, covariate, the exponential of coefficient is greater than one, right? It means that the length of survivor uh, decreases. So it means uh, when age is increasing, the length of survivor is decreasing, all right? Let me show you how to uh, get these uh, coefficients uh, in Excel by using uh, this log partial likelihood formula. Right? Uh, we actually set uh, theta j as exponential of xj multiplied by vita. So let's set vita as zero. It's an initial value. Then x vita can be calculated by a merge of data matrix comma and coefficients then press ctrl shift enter right we can apply this formula for other cells and exponential vita actually this one theta z can be calculated by exponential of x vita right then we need to clearly understand this part and this part. It means that uh, we only use uh, this summation uh, once uh, event happens. And this is the sum of all uh, occurred events. So if f is there equals one, then we use the formula. So x vita is one minus log of uh, sum of theta z. So sum of theta z. Then we need to fix the last column here.
and uh, if v2 is not equal to 1 then we give it a value as 0 right then let's some calculate sum of all uh, partial likelihood this part right so this sum of uh, partial low likelihood uh, actually this one so once you have um, a cox page model you can uh, calculate uh, basic uh, i mean uh, low likelihood for initial value right and it provides two uh, low likelihood so the first low likelihood is from uh, initial value then let's uh, minimize some of uh, local likelihood to get uh, regression coefficients for Cox pH model. Click server. Then we can uh, set objective, uh, this one, and uh, we need to, we want to maximize this uh, local likelihood, some of local likelihood, while changing this regression to uh, these two uh, coefficients. Then click solve. Right, then this is same as uh, this one, right? So exponential of coefficients. Cool. So again, uh, I showed you how to estimate, how to estimate parameters uh, by using uh, log likelihood, log partial likelihood in this video. So I hope it was useful to understand how to apply this uh, formula to get uh, regression, I mean, uh, these coefficients uh, from for uh, ba uh, Cox proportional hazard regression model. Please click like and subscribe uh, if it was useful for you. Thank you.